Leave it to Jeannie. Welcome to the meeting. Welcome, sir. Give me a second. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Where are the boys? Oh, we're, we're early. I guess we're early. You got so these. Uh, so these are trust fund babies, these guys coming in? <laughs> uh, I don't believe so, sir. I don't think they are. But uh... okay, well, I'll introduce myself since we're here. My name is Timothy Vant. Timothy J. Vant, and uh, the J stands for jerk off. I <laughs> am here tonight to pitch Benny's banana bread. And here's a sample. I made a sample. This is not a perfect recipe, but we'll improve on it. What is this powder? There's powder everywhere. I don't know. You made it. I don't know. I made it. Tie. Yeah. It's probably icing sugar. <laughs> it's just icing sugar. Bad. That looks better. Do you have a tie? No, I don't have a poppy. Get a poppy on. You know, you were bragging in the chat that you were that you were honoring your grandfather. Was it your great grandfather? I was, but I didn't have a poppy today. But I I went to the cenotaph earlier too. Yeah, my great granddad was in the was in the Second World War. Both of them on both sides. Great granddad. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Not your grandfather. You're older. Great granddad. (laughs) Great granddad. (laughs) You're you're older uh, than me, so I'm surprised you wasn't. I'm timeless. Grandpa. I'm timeless. I I don't age, Benny. You should know this. Yeah, you're a vampire. Yeah. He wants <laughs> to be a vampire. So you you're a couple beers in, are you? No, just one. I'm about to crack another. Don't drink Hold too on. much. You want to be on top shape, tip top oh, shape. I for will this. be on tip top, tip top shape for this. Okay. Because I'm not an alcoholic. I just sometimes drink. Sure, sure. Uh, you can see my reaction there. I got these little reactions here. I see that. So where do you do that? Well, it's down the bottom. It says react. So you can see I got some rockets going now, some little rocket ships. Oh. Are you on? Weird. You're on a desktop, or are you on a laptop? I'm on my phone. I'm on my phone. Oh, well, you might not have the same options then. Sometimes it's. Uh... Uh, oh, I have reactions. Here we go. Yeah, reactions. Okay. So you want to talk about the company? Yeah, there you go. You want you want to talk about the company, uh, like what we're doing here? Well, I think we should wait for the rest of them to come okay. in, right? Well, can you just fill me in? Because I don't know what the fuck we're doing. <laughs> oh, okay. Like Is my reaction presentation, on, right? Is that, does that reaction just stay for a second when it leaves? Yeah, it's just one little oh. thing. But when I do it, I get a whole bunch of them. I can get like I can fill the screen full of them. Like if I if I am in a party mood, I can just do. I see that. Do that yeah. 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 Can you do that? Okay, I don't cool. think so. I don't know. I'm not going to try. Anyways, um, we're <laughs> going to talk about um. The my cock is bigger than your cock, okay, Benny? If there's your, you know, my cock is longer. I have more girth. You know, if you want to talk bananas, if you want to pros- talk brass tacks, you know, who's got the biggest? Well, cock I'd rather talk here? about eggplants. You know. They're bigger. <laughs> or zucchini yeah, or yeah. cucumbers. We all would. We and all long, would. A, a long English cucumber. Now that, you can't beat that. Can't beat it. Where's the little lady? Are you going to introduce the little lady? She's not is here she right now. No. Oh, don't lie to me. She is there. No, she's not. No? She's oh. working? Does she work nights? Uh, she's working. Yeah, she is working tonight, actually. She, oh, she is works nights. Uh, okay. Community center, yeah. What do you think of this window behind me? That's kind of cool, huh? Yeah, that's all right. It's actually painted. That's painted. That's a painting. Window. A painting. It's not a real window. You can never tell, I, right? I, can, I could never tell. That's, you can never that's tell. amazing. Wow. It almost looks like you got a window with a curtain there. And it looks so real. I, I just, I don't know what to say. Yeah, I'm going to give Peter a call. Because um, he's, uh, so we're pitching to Peter tonight. I'm just going to make sure he's he's conscious. I've got him as Peter O'Toole bag in my phone. <laughs> Peter O'Toole bag. Remember Peter O'Toole? So we're giving Peter a call now. He's on speaker. Okay. Uh, hi, may I, uh, can you put me through to Peter? I have Peter. Peter, it's Timothy Vant. I'm here on uh, the on Zoom with Benjamin Stanley. We're a little early. Uh, we just thought we'd check with you. If, if you have, if you can hop on, we'd love to have you. Yeah, no, I appreciate it. I- Probably be on like ten or fifteen minutes. Sweet, sweet. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, we're ready to go. Um, anytime, but we can wait till eight o'clock if you need the time. So no rush. 
sounds good, bro. Hey, you're pretty good on the phone. We're pumped. We are pumped, man. We're pumped and ready. We got a, a great pitch for you. We we hope. I mean, I don't want to be, uh, you know, I don't want to be a cock about it, but, you know. I am trolling. I, you know, I, I am a comedian, so I do troll a little bit. So, you know, I apologize for that. But, you know, Benny's a straight up guy. He's honest, right, Benny? Very honest. <laughs> Yeah. One thousand percent. He's, a straight, he's yeah. a straight shooter. Yeah, I am a straight shooter. Yeah, see you shooting. Yeah. Okay. Oh, hey, Peter, do you know how to tie a, a full Windsor? Because I've been tying this half Windsor, and it looks like shit. Hey, I don't know how to tie the old. It's not hockey tape. <laughs> like a zipper tie. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get along well. All right, we'll talk soon. Oh. So you, you know see? how to do a full Windsor? Can you tie a full Windsor? No, I have no clue. But do you want to see uh, before we... Uh, how do I change the camera around here? No, I don't want to see your fucking banana. Keep it in your pants. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll be. I'll, I'll keep that. I'm not talking about that. Hold on a second. You're always talking about that. So this is where the magic will happen? Yeah. No, so I said, I said I got double sinks, right? Double sinks. Oh, okay, so you're going to do the kitchen tour. Perfect. There is a kitchen yeah. here, too. I'm in the community hall, so I can show the kitchen here if we have time, but I don't know if we'll have time. So, banana bread can go in there. Oh, yeah. oh. Do you want to start with the kitchen tour, or do you want to do that after? Well, I think we'll we'll do that after. Okay. Like, we'll get the boys yeah. in the chat. And yeah. Then, um, now, what's the other guy's name? There's Peter old O'Toole bag, and who's the other guy? <laughs> I know that's what's, uh, real, what's Peter's real last name. Celine. Okay. Well, that's a boring last name. So he's Peter O'Toole bag from now on. <laughs> uh, okay. So Benny. So this is the Benny banana. I'm just taking some notes. Benny banana bread. November 11th. It's a portal day. This is a good day to do this. Exactly. You're spiritual, right? Yeah, I believe. So if we do this intentionally, and you want to do this for real, right? You want to actually make this your job. Because yes. I think we could bring in a decent amount of money. We sure can. But do we have enough to, to satisfy shareholders? Like, we're basically inviting these guys in to be shareholders. And one <laughs> share is going to be 5500 $5, no. bucks, right? For one share? Or 1% 1 of the company? Is that what we're offering? <laughs> so that, that puts our valuation at uh, 550000 right? $550,000. No. Yeah, if we're... If, oh, 10% at 5500 What? You're confusing me. We're giving them 10% for 5500 No, no, no. 5%. Maybe 5%. Not 10%. That's too much. Okay, so what's the... I don't, I don't, I don't crunch numbers like so that. You, so what's the you and I each get 45%. If we're 50, 50 partners, we each get 45%, which leaves us a 10% wiggle room. So we can offer them each. If there's two guys, we can offer them each 5% for 5,500 bucks. So what does that oh. put our valuation at? 5,500 bucks times 20. What is that, Benny? That's uh, uh, like a hundred, 110,000. 110,000. Perfect. So that's our valuation is $110,000. I think that's actually that fair, actually. We haven't put that money in yet, but we will. We'll yeah. find our shareholders. So we're, we're offering two shares, 5% and 5%. And these are pre-sale shares. So these are, they're not really shares. They're like pre-sale certificates. What are we calling these things? Well, you call it private equity. Private equity, uh, certificates or we need like a fancy name a private equity preferred uh preferred shares like class a class a preferred shares or preferred we'll call it a preferred, class a, preferred we'll call it a preferred a uh ticket we'll call it a ticket uh i can even get some tickets made up we can print something up this is a so, private placement okay <laughs> private placement yeah so, and then you and I, that leaves us with 45% of the company each. And we haven't put any money in yet. We're going to be honest about that, right? Mm -hmm. Or have we put in money? Do you have money to put in right now, Benny? At this very moment, no, I do not. Nothing? But Zero? Tomorrow, okay. tomorrow, I could have something to buy some bananas. Tomorrow. So, I should we, I'm wondering if we should open an account like a PayPal or a, uh, 
like just a, or even just like a, uh, a an account through a, a um, not one of the big five banks, but what do they what do you call the little banks like Valley First? What do you call those guys? Like a credit, a, a credit, union, credit union. Credit union. Yeah. We should probably open that a business a account. Hmm. Do you want me to take well, care I of that, would, or do you want do you want to do that? Um, I could probably. I don't know. Because you mentioned a website, do you want to get started on the website, and then I can get started on the financial stuff? No, I'll have to talk to. Uh, I know who I can talk to about starting a website. Okay, and I think you know too. Wink, wink. No, I don't know. Somebody I know, the janitor. The cleaners? No, no, no. Aunt. Anthony? No. Oh, really? She does websites? Really? Yeah, the yeah, husband? yeah. Not the husband. No, 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 no. She no, does. no, 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 no. Okay, no. yeah, you should ask her. You should ask her if yeah. she'll do it. Would she do it for free? Would she do it for a percentage of the company? I think this... I just have to pay her some sort of fee to set it up, and that's it. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Do you want me to talk to her? Are you going to reach out to her about that? I can reach out to her about that. Okay. If, okay. So I'll get an account really set up. I'll get you a card. <laughs> so I'll, I'll set up a, an account through credit union. I'll get you a card. I'll have a card. I think we all need to be only card holders and then I'll get you the password for it. So we both have access to it. Uh, mm -hmm. No gambling though, Benny, no fucking gambling with that account. <laughs> yeah, no, you can't use it to gamble. Are you self excluding right now? No? Yeah, you fucking liar. You're gambling every day, right? You're betting right now <laughs> on something. What are you betting on? Are you logged into stake right now? <laughs> no. No? I, no, I signed not. up for that. I know. And you need to deposit because... I haven't I done need... that yet. Yeah. Well, do it because I need to start getting some of that commission. That sweet commission, baby. That's what it's all about. And if we get Benny's banana bread, then you'll get have money coming in. It'll be flowing, baby gonna be It'll flowing be yeah. yeah it's gonna be flowing so what were we doing so i'm setting up the accounts credit union probably valley first is the best in that area uh i used to have valley first now i'm with the one of the big banks and you're gonna contact dory about a potential or something or some website, website design yeah. i didn't know she did that stuff okay yeah she did it for the um secret society okay you know? now do we want what peter is <laughs> what is peter's good at accounting like what is he good at i guess we'll wait till he's here i guess he's good at selling insurance he's an insurance salesman yeah what in this meeting i think so yeah i think so something like he's that. getting muted for sure if you no, try well, i don't know in this insurance meeting. i mean that I mean, we're all probably going to be trying to sell each other something, right? <laughs> no, we're not selling anything. What we're doing is we're providing an opportunity. We're opening a door for them. Oh, yeah, we're yeah. Not that's selling right, anything. Right. I would never we're try to sell selling. anyone anything. No, no like no. what I mean by not selling, I mean selling on the business. Like, you know, like saying like, yeah. hey, this, we have an opportunity yeah. and this is a business opportunity that you can jump in and get a piece of. It's not and... even an opportunity at this, at this stage of the game. It's just an idea. It's, but it's a, it's, it's a more premium idea. idea. We, this yeah. is this, we've kind of gone a bit further than it's an idea. Like it's a top tier it. notion, is what it is. It's a yeah, top tier it, notion. But yeah, I think what we need to do is we need to bang out a, 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 of... a the best fucking banana bread. Like we need a really like it needs to taste good. It needs to look good. Yeah, people need to be willing to spend money on it. It needs to be addictive. So if we can put you know some sort of substance in there that people are going to get addicted to. Uh, that is <laughs> is not illegal, right? Nothing illegal. <clears throat> no. Uh, well, everything is well, everything illegal in this illegal. province. So, but 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 the problem with if we put that in there, like say for example, weed, right? Yeah. We're gonna have to get a um Health Canada license. Oh really? Right. Well, we'll need yeah, we'll need an inspection on the kitchen, right? How hard is that? We should get the ball rolling on that. I think that's pretty easy. Um, is it? That won't be that won't be hard. I think the hard part though is they 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 have limited time to inspect kitchens, so you have to schedule. But I, I wonder too. Well, I wonder too. Is there a yeah. difference between baked goods 
and just food in general like probably it's probably stuff. easier for just baked goods i imagine baked but i could goods, not be the same I'm, I'm, i assume yeah. that it would be actually easier to do something with baked goods let me look i'll look it up right now cooking. let's see bc health yeah okay kitchen inspection is that what well i would just say see. like what kind of license would you need health for authority. fraser for health authority baked yeah. goods? Well, not Fraser. Oh, like a business authority. license? Not... You just need a license from the the town of or the district of RCDO. RDOS. Right? R RDOS. RDOS. Yeah. Is it them or is it the? It's probably the town of Penticton. Well, RDOS is ran like they run everything in. Penticton. I'm going to call those guys tomorrow because I want to pitch. Uh, I want to put in a proposal to run that campground for personal reasons. It would be fun. <laughs> Can you imagine if people drove up and it was this guy? <laughs> this guy. <laughs> Remember that me, motherfucker? <laughs> uh, that was some people hilarious. would laugh. They would think it was funny, actually. But then some you people just would... just sit there with, like, I don't know. A sawed-off like, shotgun. What, what, That's all you need is a sawed-off shotgun. Off shotgun. <laughs> just sit there in a chair, a sawed-off shotgun at gate. You gonna pay me, they motherfucker? Talked about yeah. it, but he never actually showed anything like that. <laughs> If you show over there with me, you're like, hey, look, don't fuck yeah. around. And they're like right in front of them. They're like, oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. Funny. Oh, here we are. Um, Requirements for, for a new food business in British Columbia. So here we're just looking through regulations. This is becoming real very quickly. <laughs> Welcome to operating food business, Fraser Health Region. But you're Questions for requirements. Yeah. Where I'll send Samilkmeet? you this. I'm going to send you this. the Okanagan Similkmeat. That's a different region. Is it? Oh, Fraser Health is different? Fraser okay. Health Authority is not... That's down at the um, coast. That's right. Yeah, okay. I thought yeah, they handled the whole province, though. No? Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's different here. It's... um, Shit, what's it called? Um, Interior Health? No. Interior oh, Health, it? yeah. That's it, it is Interior that's Health? It. Okay. Interior Health That's authority, what came up yeah. when I searched Okanagan. Inspection. This yeah. looks actually easier. <laughs> uh oh disclaimer <laughs> this site is best used using google chrome okay oh, whatever no, what are you using oh brave browser i'm using brave so. browser yeah i know you're a fan yeah. of brave browser you get the I points love brave browser. number one number one number one tim berners number lee one. guys tim berners lee thank you for inventing the internet thank you for all your hard work uh steve jobs fuck you um <laughs> uh, who's the other you know god rest your soul but fuck you Wait, uh bill the, gates uh, guy, fuck off. who's the guy yeah. who made uh um uh, brave browser he also made mozilla firefox yeah. oh, oh brendan yeah. ike brendan ike that's who made brave browser but he also made um mozilla is that his name firefox. brendan ike yeah or okay. i don't know how you say his last name it's e-i-c-h brendan i think i've heard it yeah ike? he used ike? to do videos when he was first releasing um Mozilla Brave browser, yeah. Oh, for Brave browser, yeah. Well, he, he yeah. did some YouTube stuff. I don't know if he's still doing it. They do a podcast. Brave Brave does a podcast like every week. Do they? They do. Yeah, I, I haven't. Can watched you watch it. it religiously? Do you? I don't. Or, I don't. You but, listen to it? No. No, but they do do it. They do. I just saw the future. You're you're going to get married this year for 2025. You're going to get married. 2025, Probably. 2026. And I'm gonna yeah, get my uh, I'm gonna get a minister's license. Do you want me to marry you guys? Sure, if you're gonna okay. be able to uh, do it in a Catholic church, that is. I uh, yeah, I can. I charge I charge three hundred dollars. Mm. But it's gonna be five hundred, so you'll get. I don't a think you can for us. Like you're not a priest, though. That minister is not. I a will priest. be. I'm getting my license. That's not a priest, though. You're a minister. That's. A I'm gonna get a minister of the Anglican Church. You can get married in an Anglican church. I don't think it's the so. same thing. It's the same thing. It's Benny. not up to me. It's not. Up don't to me. let that Dutch German midget fool you into thinking. Hey, 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 hey. It's dwarf to you. Dwarf. Sorry. Is that she, is That's that the, the preferred term? term? A dwarf. That's I apologize. The proper term. Oh. Jim, excuse hey. Mademoiselle Monsieur. Oh, I didn't realize that. Shit. So, you, so midget is derogatory. Is midget really derogatory? It's very derogatory. Yeah. Yes, okay. Sir. Looks like Peter's oh, here. Fine. Welcome, Peter. Come on in. Oh. We're just looking up uh, the health inspection uh, for the interior health. 
Uh, Benny's got a kitchen, so we got to get the inspection happening as soon as possible for that, for the banana bread operation. Frequently asked questions. Why does Interior Health make inspection information available to the public? Do you know the answer to that one, Benny? Put up your hand if you know the answer. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. Freedom of Information Act, I guess. I don't know. Okay. So I guess you just have to call them and set up a time, right? But I heard there's there can be a waiting list. Like if you want to get your facility inspected, I think it can be kind of a waiting list, but. Mm. Most Does people don't want my, to be inspected, uh, but I know Does that, that you're open to inspection. Does that mean, yes, I am. But does that mean in the meantime, I have to go take my business to the reserve? Maybe you could sell direct. What's your email address, Ben? Do you have an email address? Uh, I don't want to give it out. Okay, can you can you text me your email address? Yeah, I can I can text you. I'm going to need it. Yeah, I will need it. All right, give me. Some. Peter's here. Welcome Peter. How's it going you guys? Pretty good. Pretty How's good. Going? Good. You guys are looking looking spiffy. Virtual <laughs> fist bump. Virtual you fist too. bump. Here we go. You too. Boom. Oh. Let's do it, Benny. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Welcome. I think so we're tied, here at seven fifty eight. There's one more person I think coming in, maybe two. Oh, we yeah, might have some good. trolls. We might have a few trolls show up. Hopefully not too many. Yeah. So Peter, um, tell us about your background. I don't know you. I know you and Ben. Did you guys go to high school together or college? Yeah, we went to elementary school and a little bit of high school together for sure. I dropped out okay. of high school oh, in grade nine, I think I believe, when I when I dropped out of that. So we did we grew up together for sure in elementary and in Oliver? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. One of our former prime or uh, one of our former premiers of this province was from Oliver. You know that statue that's outside of Town Hall? Yeah. John Oliver. Oliver wouldn't <laughs> exist if it weren't if it weren't for that man, Oliver would not exist. He had a vision for that region. Uh that's he was cool actually, that you know that. I know a lot of things. Yeah, I know a lot of things. You know, not to yeah. brag. <laughs> you you have passed through Oliver, let's just say, right? No, I've never been there. I've never, I've never been there. <laughs> well, just, let me put it this way. I can never go back. <laughs> I can never go back there. <laughs> you just know a lot of a lot of facts from all over the world without being there. Well, British Columbia. I know a lot about British Columbia history. Yeah, born and raised, baby. I'm from the Caribou region. I'm up. You, I'm up near Quinell. You know where Quinell is? I yeah. Think you said yeah. you have a cousin up here or something. Well, no, I have my brother in Prince George. You're you're in Wales, right? Is that that's what you said? Wales, BC. Yes, that's right. Uh, I have a uh, a sample of the banana bread. So we're we're working on uh, a com a concept called Benny's banana bread. I don't. Did you see? I, the clip I saw here? the video. Yeah. The yeah. Video? It's, it's a little rough. It's a little silly, but uh, this is it a sample. Seems, it seems very moist from the video. It seems well, like. Well, let it's me take it out of the package moisture. here. I mean, it's, it's wrapped up, but I'll take it out <laughs> and I'll I'll let you have a good look at it. And the concept is that we want it to be reduced sugar because people are trying to. Um, Oh, just Reduce give me one the amount second. of sugar. Tim, sorry not to interrupt you here. Um, t Ty is wondering how to get in. Just one second here. Yeah, no worries. And yeah. So uh, there's the uh, sample. We're we're still working on the recipe. Like we haven't perfected the recipe, but we want it to be a high end product. We want to offer a buttercream, uh, like a buttercream glaze or um, frosting for it, and also a, a cream cheese frosting. So we'll also have two organic. choices of frosting. Organic bananas only. Yeah. It's or organic, is what you said. All organic, organic everything organic. Yeah. yeah. You have well, a big. You have a big passion for baking, Ben. I used to. Well, I yeah, grew up in a, my big. one of my first I, jobs was a, a baker's assistant, actually. So I have knowledge in the area. Okay, and then you, you yeah. Ben. I yeah, I've done some baking. Um, like I did do like seven years in a kitchen, so I did some baking as well. I was Are you a red that, seal, but... Ben? Do you have a red seal? No, I don't have a red seal. No. Well, you don't need it. I don't think you need it. 
But mm-hmm. uh, I think it's. But I do like to bake. I I, I, I I do like to bake. You know, like even with my mom, like when I was a kid, I used to bake like all the time. With my mom when I was a little kid, and I I love doing that. Nice. That's awesome to hear. Here, here's Ty. Good. Ty Gunnard good Nelson, welcome. Partner. He's got triple barreled. Ty Gunnard Nelson, ladies and germs, welcome. <laughs> Yes. Nice to meet you, Tim and Ben. How are we yes. doing tonight? Virtual. We Good. did the virtual fist bump. Let's do one with Ty. Oh. There we go. Oh. Yes. Welcome. Oh. I like your setup there. Nice office, man. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Very yeah. good. Very good. I like I like your, your outfit. What are you wearing jacket-wise there? Oh, I got this jacket. I think I found this at the at the garbage dump. Uh, but it's quite <laughs> nice. Um, and this tie was given to me. <laughs> Nice. That's awesome. These, oh, I really cool. like these windows here. I mean, an, an area, these are actually paintings, but they, they look like windows. I don't know how they look mm-hmm. on your screen. What do you what do you imagine is outside of could, the could like, have fooled me, man, to be honest with you. If you didn't say that, I might not have noticed that. Yeah, they're paintings. They're they're really cool. Sweet. I, I like might that. do zooms from here often. Just you you could cool. be anywhere right now, theoretically, anywhere. right? Yeah. That's incredible. That's incredible. Have you seen my YouTube program? I have a YouTube show called Gong Show Tarot Live to Tape. And I it's often like weird locations. I'm always in a different spot every time I record an episode. I had uh, Ben Stanley actually on as a guest. He was once represented me as a talent agent. I since fired him. We're friends now <laughs> and uh, co-workers. But uh, yeah, you're fired as my agent, Benny. Yeah, he, didn't, he, didn't, he didn't make the cut? What's... Have the well, you tell them what happened. You tell them what happened, Ben. I don't like to <laughs> count this. I don't know what happened. You explain it. <laughs> <laughs> apparently, no I owe two thousand dollars. Apparently. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll talk about that later. We don't have to talk about that now. <laughs> I got, I got you the gigs. What can I say? It's yeah. You know, I told okay, Ben. Do you want to start? Do you want to start telling Ty and and Peter what we're trying to do here? Okay. You so, uh, yeah, you could you can kind of explain it. Sure. First, okay. So, I... so basically, one of the the business ideas we have is for Benny's banana bread. Benny will literally be the face of the company, and uh, what we want it to be is for farmers markets, like high end, direct to market. Uh, it's a pretty simple concept. It's just healthy banana bread. I made a sample last night. I was showing Peter. Uh, we haven't perfected the recipe yet. We're still in the phase of um of so are you guys the doing this like kind of virtually? Like you guys are in different locations, but you guys are teaming up and brainstorming exactly. we're, Zoom calls. We're doing how to it make all remotely. All remotely. Yeah. Okay. So I mean, I do occasionally I go down to the Okanagan, but yeah, for now it's all remote. I'm just gonna interject it. So yeah. my plan with this is we're gonna each do our own banana bread recipes, but we're gonna try to make it work together. But He's going to do it where he's at and start selling out there. And then I'm going to do it here in Penticton and in my area and start selling here. So we're both going to try to get like licenses to actually do this. I don't know what we have to figure out what kind of licenses we well, need. Probably like food safe. Food well, safe yeah, of course. Good start. Yeah. 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 yeah, for sure. But I mean, like you got to get a Health Canada license. Like you got to be approved by Health Canada, right? For See, it's a very limited reason. market up here, Ben. But then like, again, you have a much larger market. Again, but, yeah. But then again, when you go to a farmer's market, right? There's a lot of people that probably are just making big goods and they don't have licenses for that kind of stuff. Like That's true. I don't think everybody is that's selling has actual licenses to sell legally i I mean i don't know but what i'm saying is i think that they just buy a table space and they sell their products right so we'll have to look more into that i'm not totally 100 percent sure with that but yeah so anyways tim go on that's all i wanted to say could i could i ask a question and absolutely thank you for sharing this this is super awesome i appreciate uh, being invited to hear what you guys are up to. I'm curious, what was the inspiration for the banana bread in particular? And 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 what brought you guys together? Why do you feel like it makes sense right now to do this business for you guys together? You want to answer that, Ben? Or? <laughs> I will answer. It's more or less just like, a, it kind of started off as maybe like kind of like a joke. Right, like my name's Ben, obviously, and Benny's Banana Bread Company sounds fucking hilarious. 
So we, <laughs> we thought that that was like a good idea because, you know, when you sell something, it's all in a name, right? So like, yeah, you can make anything out of anything. Just the name, the name yeah. alone would sell, yeah. sell the it's banana a, bread. Yeah, it's a great concept, I think. Like, And the idea, I think that like the joke idea was that it would be Benny would be direct selling at a like a farmer's market. He would have That's Benny's little... banana boat. So he'd have like a little boat there with the branding. He'd have a couple of girls there with him in yellow bikinis. And, you know, so the, the visual of this would be quite attractive to to visitors. And the idea would be to just sell out, like just to kill it, right, every right. week. Yeah, of course. And so it kind of came from you guys just being friends, you know, messing around with each other, just kind of like riffing. And then you came up with the banana bread idea. What are is we like friends? The... I don't know. Are we still friends? <laughs> I don't know. Friends. Do I owe you three thousand dollars? Are we still friends? You owe me three thousand dollars, Benny. I don't know. You're coming. For you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't owe you nothing. It was sixty yeah. forty. Sixty forty. Remember that. And right. you guys obviously have like a plan to make it more than just a uh, like banana bread farmers market company, right? Like you guys have a a scaling yeah. strategy. That's a great question. That's a great question. Like, because I mean, you could decide to franchise it. That's one way that you could do is sell the name and the branding, which is what a lot of like really, if you put a lot of money and time into developing a brand, that's actually one strategy. I don't know. What do you think, Benny? Um, I think what's good to start off with is pages on Facebook, Instagram, maybe a Twitter. I don't know what x.com now they call it. I think basically like starting those kinds of pages and getting the message sure, yeah, out. Yeah, for marketing. Yeah, absolutely. For marketing, for but marketing for scaling, purposes. like for scaling the business. Right now you're talking, you want me to have a location up here and you have a location there. But then as you grow, like, do you want to franchise out and people buy the franchise or do you want to expand and, and, and keep proprietorship of every single Benny's banana stand or boat or whatever it is? I think we could expand the business. Like basically we could actually have franchise. Like that's the best way to go. I think to franchise a business out. I mean, you look at something like McDonald's, for example, right? McDonald's is all franchise. They make a shit ton of money every year. And basically they make money from just, you know, mostly rent really like, having well, buildings. real estate they become basically they become yeah. real estate investors yeah so that's a good way to make money for sure um but i haven't totally decided if we should just do it as a like a mom and pop shop type of thing for a while and just keep all the proceeds and or expand and let other people decide to have a franchise and buy that franchise i I don't know yet, but what I do think we should just kind of just start. Obviously, we gotta start small because we don't have much capital. And I, I um, sorry to jump in there again. So yeah. that's awesome. I love it. I th I appreciate you sharing sharing your guys' vision with that. I think it's so cool when people actually have you know the nerve, right, to like have an idea and be like, hey, the audacity. Let's do something with that idea. You know what I mean? Like not a lot of people actually will get on a call, arrange a call to talk about what is this going to look like for us, right? And I love that when I asked like why, you know, why banana bread and why like you guys would do this together, you talked about like alliteration and the nature of something being really catchy and kind of funny and, and fun, you know, like something that can provide value to people's lives and at the same time can be fun and have a really good, you know, self self brand or a personal brand. Is that kind of correct? What you guys were talking about? Yeah, there? that's you. You really put it into words, Ty. Is you know, with the alliteration and uh, and, and the buzzwords, and just the, you know, Ben and I, we have sort of a natural rapport. We've known each other for about four years now, I guess. That's about the right. That's about right. Yeah, something like that. <clears throat> yeah. So I, I think that. it's a good partnership in that way. That's awesome, man. I uh, yeah, I don't sure. know if you guys actually know or not. Let's see if. I just sent a, a screen sharing request. I'd love to show you something. I see that. Yeah, I, I'll hit allow. Yeah, go ahead. 
This is our team's Instagram. And so we, me and Peter, I don't know how much you know about what Peter and I do, um, but I know a little bit. I'm adding you right now to the Astronomical Spa Society. Beautiful. That sounds great. Me and Peter essentially are a part of a company that help change people's lives financially. Our brokerage name, or at least our team name is called Geist Gunnard. So when you said the alliteration was something that you <laughs> value, I was like, oh, that's awesome. That's my, uh, that's my home court. That's what you do. Yeah, yeah. That's my home right. court for sure. Yeah. I, uh, I've built personal brands for a few other people I know. My dad has hundreds of pepper plants he grows. He has a hot sauce brand and I've helped him come up with the name Wicked Willie's Hot and my mom does uh, cooking and hers is called Josephine Gem. So it's really ironic that you mentioned alliteration. But anyway, I just got you uh, three more followers. You just got three more followers. Beautiful. Let's go. Pump it up. Let's go. I, I wanted to show you that this is some of the people on our team, just in our local area down south. There's Peter, as you can see, there's me. And this is just a handful of the people, a part of our brokerage. And they all have that common value and mission of what you guys are talking about, which is helping people, you know, giving them a good time, being a part of something fun that can be entrepreneurial and make you money and help you stand out in a really big way as well, too, right? Like you want to yeah. be, you want to be able to say, hey, like I'm, I'm Benjamin. I am, you know, I have this business, you know, you want to be able to attach yourself to a really exciting thing. Benny's banana bread can also be something that 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 can drive other areas of your life if you build a personal brand. And uh, I mentioned this because me and Peter's company and our team is actually expanding as well too. And I don't know if there'd be any interest on your guys's part or not, but essentially what we do is very similar to what you guys are looking for in regards to building something that can help you help people make you money and build a personal brand as well too. And so uh, what was your answer again, when you'd mentioned why, why banana bread? Like, was it mainly just, just the name, the idea, and you guys have, you know, had banana bread before yeah, the massive oh. passion for bananas in specific. Yeah. Is it like a specific massive passion for, for that yeah. or? Is it going to be very niche to banana? Mag magnesium, products? magnesium no. and vitamin K. Gen Z are, are deficient. A lot of people are deficient in magnesium and vitamin K. So for me, it's about mm. uh, distributing a healthy product, something mm. that people have easy access to that can help boost certain minerals that they might be lacking. Yeah, I love, I love that. that you're taking a nutrition science approach to that as well. What were you going to say, Benny? I was going to say, uh, Peter, I was going to say uh, basically... At first, it was going to be banana bread, but I'd like to expand it into like an actual, like bake, like a baked goods company, like with other things, so yeah. muffins mm. and different types of pastries. But at first, to start off, it's so simple, so easy. Then it's in the name, Benny's Banana Bread Company, Banana Bread. A I S S, bread. right? Keep it simple, stupid. Yeah. yeah. You know, and that and, works. And, I think that really and not works, just like we're going to have a couple types of banana breads. We're going to have a uh, circular banana bread, and then we're going to have a rectangular style banana bread as well. So people got the option to have either a rectangular banana bread or a circular banana bread. So it's not just like it's a little you know, bit, yeah. Cool. You, you it's got a little options. Bit unique you got the, options. The, yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. For sure. Yeah, I like, it, you're, like when you get a banana bread, right? Usually in the store, it's like rectangular shape, right? Yeah, how fucking boring is that? It's I'd just like basic. Like, but yeah. but it's it's a catchy name. 